In 2023, I traveled thousands of miles magnet fishing in my boat. This is a movie showcasing three different magnet fishing trips that I took to the same area. Magnet fishing, baby. Look at this. We got snow all over the place. What is going on today, guys? Today, we are back out on the old magnet fishing mobile. Today, I got Alex out here with me, and we are going to be doing some more magnet fishing. Check you know, right behind me guys we got this big old juicy looking bridge we pretty much tossed the anchor in right next to this bridge here we're gonna start tossing our magnets around and we're gonna see if we can find anything here today look at that you guys look at this big old fish lure yeah. setup alex got him what was that like your second throw yeah second throw nice. all right you guys today we have our large 360 degree magnet with us and alex is throwing the exact same thing i got us anchored off right next to this bridge here let's just start tossing and see if we can find anything today. Oh my, that's pretty deep in here, dude. Yeah, yeah. Holy cow. I suppose with the bridge and everything, it's probably gotta be. Oh, what's that? I got something. Oh, or does something got me? What is going on here? Oh my, I had something for a second. I think we popped right off. Huh, that was a little funky feeling. Ooh, what the heck? First throw of the day, you guys. Doesn't look like a whole lot of anything on there, but a bunch of debris. Look at, there's like two half little broken washers, couple little nuts and bolts, bunch of rocks. Nothing too crazy, you guys. Here we go. You got something on there? Yep. From the deepest From the, I know it's deep. No, oh, shut oh, up. Oh, <laughs> just upgraded our anchor right no more, dude <laughs> no more drift in here man no way the, size of this the old claw anchor sure. heck yeah Get dude back. all right you guys alex found him a pretty nice anchor let's keep tossing see what else we can find in here oh that's an old school beer can check that label out there look bro. at that you guys look at this old beer can he got oh look at that's chief chief oshkosh i've, I've never yeah, seen look at this you guys like chief that. oshkosh beer it almost looks like an old oil can you're yeah, right. right that's pretty cool that it's sucker it's cool. actually in like not that bad no, of condition not at all man this one's probably gonna end up on the shelf there that's a nice find there sure, man. what in the heck is going on here it's like i have something hooked on the anchor dude it feels like i got something hooked on the anchor i'm not even kidding dude i do oh, there's a rope oh get it i'm not even kidding you i just hooked a rope i'm dead serious I hooked so hard. <laughs> just hooked the anchor up. What's this? Someone else's rope. Dude, there's something on this. Wait, what the is this? The coolest find of the day didn't come from a magnet. <laughs> what is going on here? It's not moving. What is that, yo? Maybe that's what we're getting our magnet caught on. It might be somebody's, uh, it might be somebody else's magnet that they got caught on something. It's like lifting, but. You can like feel it. You can pick it up and set it back down. You can get it to a certain point and then it and then it like gets stuck. It's like you can tell it's it's like an it feels like an anchor stuck on a tree or something. Well, I don't know what the heck is on the end of this rope, you guys. My guess would be probably another anchor, but whatever it's stuck to, obviously this rope snapped for a reason. So I don't think we're gonna be getting this thing out. Oh, there she goes. heck was that oh something i'm feeling there i think i got it heck yeah dude i got something here and this feels decent oh boy what is this wow that feels heavy oh my dude, goodness look at that, dude. what the heck is this dude 
Dude, more Oh, look at that, you guys. Evidence. Check it out. It looks like this is a railroad plate, but I can't really tell. I don't know. I see a couple oh, holes yeah. in there. Just Other than that, man, just a bunch of nails and probably <laughs> some more bridge metal here, you guys. Nothing crazy yet. Uh-oh. What the heck is that? Ooh, something here, dude. No, 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 maybe not. I don't know what that was. Oh, no, there's something down there, man. I'm feeling it. What is this? It's not really grabbing, though. Huh. Oh, no, I feel some weight on there. Just a little bit. What do we got this time, you guys? Oh, <gasps> no way, dude. Look at that, you guys. It's an old pitchfork head. The handle's definitely broken off of there, but I don't know if maybe we could replace it with wood or something somehow. I don't know. Heck yeah, you guys. Check that one out. How old do you think that bad boy is, man? My goodness. Yeah, right. It had to be back when this was all farmland. Just looking at it, it looks like it would be. What do you got? Whoa, Ooh, dude. What in the world? What the heck is that? A, a weirdly shaped bucket? I don't know. It almost looks like a homemade thing. anchor, honestly. What in the world? Like maybe this is where you would tie your rope? I don't know. Oh my gosh, it that's heavy, heavy, yo. Man, it is heavy. Holy cow. Oh, what dude. is that? <laughs> that thing is cool looking. Nice. There's definitely something for some kind of hook on there. That's crazy. Let's take another look at this another time, you guys. I can feel some stuff down there, dude. I think we found us a little hot spot corner over here. see some more color look at whoa dude look at first of all looks like just a little square washer plate or something but dude look at this big old fishing lure holy cow what is that the rapala something looks like it's rubbed off can't really read it no way man oh looks like one of the fins is broken off on the back but other than that dude this thing does not look bad i wonder if you can maybe fix that fin up or i wonder i'm sure it would probably work just as good without the fin who needs it it would look like an injured fish when it's swimming with a broken wing like that heck yeah you guys a third lure here today I'm pulling something here, guys. Yeah, for show, baby. Oh, it got even heavier. Whoa, now what do I got? Holy cow. Whoa, this is heavy. What the heck? It got real heavy, real slow. Oh my gosh, what is this, yo? What's going on? Look no! Look at what yep. I found before. Shut before. up, you guys. Look at Look at it. It's literally the same it is the exact same one look at go grab yours here look at <laughs> wow, hold that dude unreal you guys look at they're, we literally literally identical man. i just caught the same type of anchor him that and, alex had and his brother holy <laughs> cow it's Check like the exact out. same size it's and yeah, everything it is. it's literally the no same. way <laughs> oh and look at there's a little fishing lure dangling up at the top yeah, stuck in there for sure man heck yeah you guys i mean these are supposed to pivot here and i think if we can get one, just one of these to move no we'll definitely be able to get these all we gotta do is soak them in electrolysis sure. and these will be workable again yeah, i think these would be a better like it would be an upgrade for our boat here. oh yeah these would dig into the muck so and and if we have two of them in. instead of just one for sure, man. yeah and if you think about it these are like 30 dollar anchors oh, sure, so we got 60 dollars <laughs> an anchor sitting right here dude not quite sure just a 
rough surface. What else do we got on here? A full cabinetry full of nails here, you guys. All shapes and sizes. Oh my goodness, what's that? Oh. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I think it's stuck in the mud. Hold on, wiggle it, wiggle it, wiggle it. It's coming, dude. I'm wiggling it out of the mud. I'm not even kidding. <gasps> Here it comes, yo. It's coming up. What is this? This is, this is, whoa. Dude, this is heavy, man. This is really heavy. I can't get it. Oh, what the heck is that? The big daddy. <laughs> the big daddy, yo. What is that, man? Is that another anchor? I don't think so. Wheel hub or something. Kind of looks like the base for something. I really don't know. Holy cow, that's heavy. Feel that. My goodness. Uh, I would say 30 pounds. Yeah, that sucker's heavy, <laughs> it dude. It almost looks, if you look real close, like there's some kind of writing or something in there. I really don't know, you guys. But if you look at the top, see this little hole in there right there? It almost yeah, looks yeah. like maybe a rope could run through there. Like it might be some kind of old style anchor. I don't know. I doubt it. If you guys have any ideas, let us know down in the comments section. Flat base on there. I don't know what that could be. Some kind of base for something. <laughs> You know what I'm thinking? Honestly, I don't know how much weight this boat can hold. I'm sure it would take quite a bit to overload the boat with too much metal weight, but... We'll find out when we start moving, you know? <laughs> oh. <laughs> you guys, there's some cool stuff in here, man. Ooh, dang, dude. That's good, dude. Oh, what is that, yo? Is that a coil? No, that's not a coil. At first, I thought it was a spring, like a car spring or something. But look, you guys, it's a bike lock. What the heck, man? Yeah, look at it. It's got the, the bike lock on there and everything. Unreal. All right, you guys, check that one out. What year do you think this one is? Holy cow. I can't say it enough, you guys. This boat is an absolute game changer. We can go anywhere, dude. We, you wanna go over there? We can go over there. You wanna go over there? We can go over there. You wanna go over that way? We can go over that way. The possibilities here are just endless, you guys. Heck yeah, you guys. Let's keep tossing, see what else we can find. You guys, I had my camera turned off. Look at what Alex this just found, crazy. man. This drill is definitely shot. I don't think that we would ever get this working again. Unreal. But dude, this bit, that bit is probably pretty, worth some money. I'm pretty sure that's either a paint mixer or a concrete mixer concrete, or something. I would say concrete over paint. Unreal, dude. Is that a Milwaukee drill or what is that? Um, I see some red. That's a good question there. I don't know. Here's or a, a healthy or whatever the heck you call them. Here's a good looking label there. There's just a chunk missing of where like the branding would be. It starts with a V. What the heck kind of a huh. brand? V is something cordless drill. Oh yeah, know. wipe that off. Wipe that off real good. Give her a good wipe. Black and Black Decker. Black and Decker. Oh yeah, weird. Industry and construction, dude. This is Look at it's that, a commercial man. grade drill. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Unreal. That was right underneath the bridge there, right along. The was it? He was probably standing right up on the bridge yeah, when he right, dropped it, sure. right? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Battery pack on there and right, everything, right. you guys. No way. Yeah, look at that. We got a clam. Put your finger in there. <laughs> what the heck was that? Just went over the top of something. I don't know if I really stuck it though. Oh, I'm like pulling the boat to it. What the heck was that? Is it on there still or what? I don't know. Yeah, I'm pulling something here, you guys. I think it just popped out of the mud. Yep. Whatever this is, this sucker's got some decent weight to it. Whoa. Whoa, dude. Look at that big old chain link piece. Holy cow, what are these, the old tow chains or something? Look at that. All right, you guys, what the heck do you think this big old chain came off of? I wonder, was it attached to something or what? Holy smokes. Oh, what is that? Oh my, hit something real good and then I came right off. What the heck was that? Or is it still on there? What the heck was that? Oh, 
Oh, I see color. Look it, heck yeah. First of all, again, man, looks like another piece of bridge metal here. But dude, holy fishing lures today. Look at, I got me a little pile started. My goodness, you guys, we are cashing out today. Fishing lures, anchors, my goodness. Ooh, what, did it hit something there? What was that? Yeah, I think it's coming with us, you guys. Oh, I just stuck another something right there. I think we might have a couple things here. That's quite a bit of weight. What is that? Whoa! What is that, man? Look at What the heck is this, you guys? Dude, what in the world? Look at how that's shaped, man. I don't even know what to think of this, you guys. Oh, look at that. There's like some ridges or some grooves on there. I don't know, man. That is super crazy looking though. What the heck do you guys think this one is, man? Super weird. Oh, what was that? Oh. Gotta climb onto something here with some good magnetic stick, but it doesn't really want to pull out of the mud. Where'd that go? Is it on there? I don't really know. Oh yeah, a little something. Oh, look at this, you guys! Holy cow! I got me a big old hinge. Ooh, ooh, ooh! Something heavy, like tipping the boat. Did you grab the anchor? Oh no, no, no! You're good. Whoa! Look at this. Oh my goodness. Dude, you that other <laughs> Look at this one. Holy oh cow, yo. Look at the size of that chain. I thought I caught a big chain in here. Look at my little chain compared to your big one. Look at that. Holy cow. It's going to be a nightmare to get off of here. What a find. And again, just another empty chain. I can't believe there's nothing attached to it, like an anchor or something. Super weird. Let's get this magnet about getting it stuck. Oh, something here. Something a little heavier. <laughs> Heck yeah, you guys. Every time I cling on to something decently heavy now, I just think it's going to be an anchor. I like expect it to be. Yeah, there's definitely some. Whoa, what is that? Color. What the heck is that? Um, hey. This is one of them like flexible, like you can put it however you want it. I guess I don't know what it is, but it's definitely flexible and you can place it however you want it. You know, I don't know what it would be for. Are those earplugs? <laughs> is that what that is? Are they squishy? No, the tips aren't really squishy. Huh, I'm thinking maybe earplugs or something like that. And boop, I don't really know you guys. That's a weird looking one, but it was wrapped up in a bunch of other stuff here. Looks like a, a little bridge bolt maybe. Ooh, hold on a second. What is this one, man? Look at that, some kind of something with some holes in it, but look at this. There's like a chain link that broke off here. What the heck do you think that is? You guys, there is some seriously cool stuff in here. We pretty much got our cart filled to the top, man. Look at that. Oh, what is that? What the heck is that? I see a little red on there, a little red and white. What the heck is that, guys? It says dot slash C. And I guess I can't really see what else. What the heck? There's like a little, look at, no, there's like a little, there's like a little fishing, uh, like a fishing swivel on there. Like you could tie a lure on there or something. What the heck is that? That is a really weird one, you guys. I don't know what to think of that. All right, you guys, we are out of time for today, but check it out. Holy cow, you guys, we literally filled the cart 
to the top with some seriously cool stuff, man. And if you count the anchors as cash, I mean, we probably have like a hundred dollars worth of stuff in here. Not a bad day at all, you guys, out on the boat. The only thing stopping us from staying out here all day, you guys, is the fact that it is just absolutely freezing out here. We even got a couple fishing lures. Heck yeah, we dude. We are packed up. I already got the boat out of the water. I'm telling you, man, if it wasn't the middle of winter and we didn't have a foot of snow on the ground, we'd be out here all day. But still, you guys, we managed to fill our cart to the top with tons of cool stuff. And we even found two anchors. Cash money, baby. Now take a look around you guys. We literally just had like a blizzard last night. We got a good six inches of snow last night and it actually just stopped snowing like an hour ago. They did a pretty good job plowing what there is here, but look at this parking lot you guys. I am literally the only person here. There's nobody out fishing on the docks. I am literally the only person out here. And check this out. I almost got my truck stuck trying to put the boat in the water. So check it out, you guys. This whole boat ramp is literally nothing but snow and ice from top to bottom. If I didn't have four wheel drive on my truck, I honestly don't think I would have made it back up there. of snow you guys and it is absolutely freezing but that is not going to keep us from magnet fishing all right guys so we're going to go ahead we're going to hop in the boat head down river start tossing our magnets around and we're going to see if we can find anything here today you guys there is so much snow out here this is honestly ridiculous all right first things first here i gotta let this boat motor warm up there we go now she's running all right, guys, I got us untied. We should be good to go. Throw this bad boy in reverse, and let's get the heck out of here. woo she's a little snowy out here, guys. I can feel that snow blowing in my face now. Under the big old city bridge we go. This is actually the drawbridge right here, you guys. This is the one that folds open. Oh my gosh, it's like raining under here. Oh, look at all the snow. Oh, there's water falling all over me, you guys. Holy cow, it's literally like raining under here. So I decided to actually move to a spot that me and Alex have been to one time. Some of you guys might recognize this little corner on this bridge. We found tons of super cool stuff here last time. So I think I'm gonna try it again and I'm gonna see if I can find anything else out here. Let's start tossing around here and see if we can find anything. Uh, I think I might have something already, you guys. Literally, first throw over here. Yeah, I think so. I feel a little bit of weight on there, you guys. Whoa, heck yeah, look at that. Literally, first throw over on this corner of this bridge. And look at what we got. A bunch of debris scrap pieces here. Couple wires. The old bridge material. But check this thing out right here, you guys. Look at this. Ugh, ugh. What in the world is that? Kind of looks like some kind of hook with like a... Maybe a flat tip screwdriver looking piece on there. See that? What the heck do you think that is? The hook right here definitely looks like it busted off. Huh, some kind of screwdriver hook looking piece. That's kind of funky. All right, you guys, first throw, we're already finding stuff. Oh, right here. Yep, something right here, you guys, and that's got some decent weight to it. What's this one? Don't tell me I caught my own anchor again or something. No. Ooh. Whoa. Oh, no way, you guys. Look at. Look at. First of all, look at all the debris on there. But no way, man. Look at. 
I just caught an axe. Holy cow, and look at the handle still on there, but man, that thing is old. Dude, that is so cool, you guys. Oh, and look at that. This side is completely full of mud and rust, and this side is like super fresh and clean. I wonder if that's because this side was probably sitting in the mud and this was all exposed for years and years, you guys. Now well, that's cool, man. You guys, we are definitely gonna be restoring this piece over on my restoration channel, The Fisher Restorations. <laughs> we got the old Axe Rooney. Oh, right there. That was something with some weight we just picked up. Heck yeah, dude. Again, something with some weight, you guys. What do we got here? Nice and slow, because I don't want it to fall off or something. Uh, yeah, here we go. Oh, it's like blue. What is this, you guys? Whoa, what the heck is this? Hold on a second. Let me get this off of there. You guys, look at I could see kind of like a blue tint on there. You can see the paint, but uh, what the heck is this, man? If you look, this almost looks like some kind of locking mechanism or something. Like on the front, maybe right on the other side here should be a keyhole or something under there. And there is right there, you can see it. Holy cow, so this is obviously some kind of uh, locking door probably for some kind of locked box or something you guys i wonder if the rest of the box is still down there tons of old stuff coming out of here and there was a little something else on there you guys look at this thing i don't know what the heck that is this side's got a little hole in it and this side is pointy what the heck do you think that is I'm dragging something here, you guys. I threw it kind of right over by the dock here. Yeah, I think there's definitely, oh yeah. Whoa, 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 we're getting heavier here. Oh, that's really heavy actually. Holy cow, man. What is this? That's like really heavy. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at all the stuff on there. First of all, <laughs> holy cow, I think this it's just a piece of rebar or something. A little bit of cash money. But look at all of these scrap wires on here, you guys. My goodness. And then there's this thing. This is the big old heavy thing that I was feeling on there. Check that one out, you guys. I know for sure Alex found one of these out here last time. It's a W. No, it's an E. No, it's an M. I don't know what this is, you guys, but I've only ever seen them around big bridges like this. Again, just a little bit more cash money. What's that there? Oh my, oh my. That's not gonna come up, is it? No, is it? Whoa, dude. You guys, what the heck is this, man? I'm telling you, I'm telling you, this is, what the heck, this shouldn't even be coming up. Uh, uh, what is this? Oh my gosh, what the? Is that wrapped in plastic too? What the heck is going on, man? Um, what is this? Is that just plastic or is it some kind of film or what the heck, man? Get that out of the water. This type of stuff is always good to get out of the water, you guys. But look at this flipping thing, man. Holy cow, that's cool looking, dude. This thing's gotta weigh like 40 pounds, man. Unreal. Look at them big old teeth on there. This has gotta be some kind of gear or something, man. Ow. Whatever this thing is, this thing's been down there forever, you guys. Look at all the rust and stuff on there. That's wild, man. There is seriously some cool stuff in this river, you guys. Ooh, dude, I just stuck something super hard and heavy again, like right next to where I just found that big old uh, gear looking piece. No way. Yeah, I am not even kidding you guys. What is this one? Whoa, oh, 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 that sucker's heavy, man. Look at that. 
It almost looks like some kind of giant bottle or some kind of container or something. I don't think so though. I'm pretty sure that's solid, man. That's the way it feels. If you look really close under there, you can kind of see ridges on there. It almost looks like this might be some kind of cap. I have no idea, you guys. Take a drink out of whatever's inside of that sucker once. Did I just like land on something, dude? Yeah, I'm like pulling myself right to something here. Uh-oh, easy there. Oh, I stuck something good. Oh yeah, that's coming with too. Dude, I, it's like almost every throw with some heavy, heavy stuff, dude, yup. Stay on there, buddy. Uh-oh, that's slipping. Slower, slower, I'm pulling a little too fast. Nice and slow, you guys. I got something big. Oh my gosh, it doesn't want to come up. Does it? No, it doesn't. Is it? Oh yeah, it is. Oh no, it's on a rope. I can't get it. Look at what it is, you guys. It's an anchor. You have literally got to be kidding me, yo. Oh my gosh, man. I think this thing would hold me way better than the one I got on right now. On real i wonder what happened there look at he tossed like almost the whole rope in my goodness is it snapped or what looks like it yup dude how many anchors is that now just on this bridge oh my goodness you guys i cannot get enough of this magnet fishing from the boat is insane oh what's that dude I just landed on something. I'm like pulling myself right to it. Ooh, easy now. Yeah, I, dude, I landed right on something and it's heavy, dude. Everything in here is heavy. Here we go. If this is another anchor, man, I will poop. I will poop my britches. Dude, this is heavy, I'm telling you. Something heavy on here for sure. What do you got this time? Oh my gosh. Whoa, dude, now that is really cool looking, you guys. Again, there's definitely some more teeth or some more gears on there. I don't even know what the heck this might be, you guys. Look at that. It almost looks like maybe some kind of lantern piece or something from back in the day, but I doubt it. Whatever it is, you guys, it's definitely some kind of gear piece, just like this big old thing we caught. We are absolutely killing it out here at this spot. Between last time with me and Alex out here and this time, holy cow, man. I can't imagine what the heck else is in there. Oh, I just stuck something again. Nah, -uh. right there. Nope, no, I came off. I definitely got something on here, you guys. This one's heavy, too. Again, man, it's back to back with the heavy finds in here. Ooh, yo, that's not gonna come up. Oh, it is, whoa. Look at that, no. You know where I seen one of these the last time? You guys might remember. Um, I've definitely found something like this. It looks like 10 different chains could go on there. What the heck do you guys think that one is, man? I didn't know what it was last time and I don't think we ever figured it out. Huh, some kind of something for putting chains on? I don't know, you guys. There's some funky stuff in here, man. <laughs> you guys, I can't get enough of this spot. It's like every throw, seriously. Uh-oh, oh, give me that quick before that gets all knotted up. Boom, right there again, man. There's no way, really. Is that gonna come up? I don't know. That's extremely heavy. This might be the heaviest thing yet, dude. This is heavier than the anchor and everything. Dude, it's coming up though. Oh my gosh, you guys. What the heck is this? I can't see and I can't get it up. I'm gonna try and reach over and grab it. Oh, oh, I can't. Oh, I got it, you guys. Whoo, couple things on that one, man. 
Check that one out, you guys. I can tell exactly what this is right away. We got us a big old railroad piece, you guys. This is literally a chunk of railroad track. This one's actually a tiny piece compared to some of them. All right, the old little train track piece. But you guys, look at this thing, man. Wow, why is that so heavy? Holy cow, the base of this feels like concrete or something. But look at that, there's like some kind of eye bolt piece sticking out of there. What the heck do you think that is for, you guys? The base down here is like thin and starting to deteriorate. I don't know what the heck this could have came off of, man, but that is a strange looking piece right there, dude. Boom, click. Yeah, dude, I got something again, man. And again, some serious weight on here, you guys. Holy cow, I can't get enough of this spot. Uh-oh, uh-oh, I did it again. No, I did it again, dude. Holy cow, you guys, as soon as I seen that red rope, first, I'm like, no way, I caught another anchor. Nope, I caught my own anchor for the second time today. Oh, that was a good stick. Heck yeah, dude. What's this one? Oh, that one's got some weight buster. Oh my goodness, every time, dude. What is this one? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh my gosh, that's so heavy, dude. Holy cow. Whoa, man, look at this one, you guys. Oh, hold on a second. Look at what's pinched in there. A little jiggerooski. I think that one's the glow in the dark color. And the hook on there don't look too bad. Nice. But you guys, look at this one, man. I don't know what the heck to think of that. It almost looks like some kind of rim or something. You can kind of see what looks like maybe spokes still on there. But then when you look over here, you see wires going across like here i don't know what the heck this is you guys i don't know it definitely looks like some kind of rim but uh for what i don't know man super funky looking you guys the amount of cool stuff coming out of here you guys is unreal oh i think we got something yeah here we go oh yeah Thought that was gonna come off right away. Oh, easy. Still might come off. Wow, this one's got a decent weight to it. Not the heaviest thing we found today, but that's actually pretty heavy. Holy cow, it's getting heavier. Dude, no, really? Oh my goodness, you guys. What the heck, yo? This one's hardly even got a rope left on there. Look at that thing. Oh, look at the big old eyeball jig on there too. Heck yeah, dude. A little two for one on the fishing gear, buddy. Oh my gosh, man. This one's like super lightweight, honestly. This is like the lightest anchor I think I've ever found. The old swivel anchor. We are seriously stacking up on the anchors, man. Oh, something here. Something heavy again, man. Dude, if, can you imagine if this is another anchor? That would be insane. Oh my gosh, it's everything is so heavy, dude. Oh, what do we got? No flipping way. Oh my gosh, you guys, what the heck? Are you serious right now? I'm literally finding them every throw at this point. I'm not even kidding. Oh my gosh, man. What in the world? And again, super frayed on the end, so I'm gonna guess that uh, it must have snapped. Oh my goodness, you guys. This one's got the big old thick anchor pieces here. And this one still kind of swivels yet. Look at that. Oh my gosh, man. I'm like freaking out right now. What the heck? I mean, if you think this is maybe a $40, $50 anchor, let's just say 40 to be safe. 40, 20, and this one's probably 30. So you're talking like $90 just in anchors, you guys. Oh my. My gosh, what the heck, man?
Uh-oh. I don't like the way that feels. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Dude, I'm stuck. Oh, no, I'm actually stuck. Like, for real. Oh, yeah. I'm snug right up in there, buddy. Holy cow. We're going to have to try some maneuvers here. This is the first time I've ever gotten actually stuck in the boat, you guys. Uh-oh. So that might explain what's happening to all these anchors here. Yeah, I'm stuck. Stuck, stuck. That's not moving, buddy. All right, I'm going to go way out this way and see if we can just pull it straight that way. Oh, just like that. Boom. Popped right out. See, that's what I was talking about. I knew having this boat, it would be a, a lot harder to get magnets stuck, you guys. Boom, something heavy right here, yup. Dude, it's non-stop with the heavy stuff and every time now, I'm, I keep thinking, is it an anchor? That's my first thought. What do we got here, you guys? Ooh, that's really heavy. Oh, whoa, that's not no anchor, buddy. Look at this one. Yo, holy cow. Our first bike find in the boat, you guys. And look at how far away from the bridge we actually are, dude. Look at how old that sucker looks too, you guys. Look at all the gunk on there. This one's been down there for quite a while. And look, I just realized no wheels at all. What the heck, man? Oh, and no handlebars. This must have been a, a chop shop bike. They chopped it up. Probably sold it for parts and then ditched the frame, you guys. I'm pretty sure they dumped the bike frames because if you get caught with a stolen bike, the bike frame is what's gonna get you caught because there's actually like a serial number on there. I don't even know what kind of bike we got, just a plain Jane Red. We caught Big Red. It's starting to snow again. I am absolutely freezing. So I'm trying to hurry up and get out of here. But look at this, you guys. Three anchors, man. That one's a nice expensive one. I think this one here is actually going to be our new anchor that we're going to use for the boat. Unreal, you guys. Holy cow, you guys. I got my boat off the water just in time. Look at you can't even see the river anymore. It is like an absolute blizzard out here, you guys. But once again, not a bad day at all. Oh, we found us three anchors and a ton of other super cool stuff. Check this out, you guys. We're about to put the boat in here and look at one person was here before us. You can see all the ice is broken up here, but there is so much ice out on the river today. This is ridiculous. Like this is almost not even a good idea. Look at this is completely frozen. You can almost go ice fishing out here. All right, guys, we got the boat loaded into the water here. We got some fresh gas in this puppy today, so we're ready to go. All right, now, yeah, let's see if I can figure out this idle. Everybody in the comments is trying to tell me how to use this thing. Is it before or after? That doesn't do anything, guys. I don't know, man. I don't know what this lever does, but every time I use it, it doesn't seem to do very much, so I guess it is what it is, huh? <laughs> oh, you guys, look at this. We are literally, oh, snap. We're scraping on ice out here. This is no joke. We are busting up ice to go magnet fishing. Shoo! All right, guys, we got to be pretty picky here. We got to take our time and go slow. There's doesn't look like there's going to be many spots open here, you guys. Not sure if you guys can really see it on camera, but I mean, there is so much ice out here, you guys. This is crazy. Oh, we got to try and navigate through the ice. Oh, no. Look at how thick that is. Is this where they went through? Oh, no, dude. Oh, no, that don't look good. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that really don't look good. Here we go, you think we're gonna make her? I think this is where they went through right here. I don't wanna floor it though. I think this is it. Solid, dude. We made her, baby. Holy cow, busting through the ice. We got magnificent. All right, you guys, back out on the boat once again. Today we have our large 360 degree magnet with us and we are dodging icebergs today. We're gonna just start tossing right next to this drawbridge here and we're gonna see if we can find anything today. Hit on a little 
little something right there already. Oh, she got some weight to it too, dude. Heck yeah. Maybe. What is going on? I feel something, dude. Uh, oh yeah. It's like there's a couple things down there. I'm bouncing over all kinds of stuff. Boop. Oh, that was a click and a shtick. Or maybe not. Dude, what is going on down there? I feel something. Doesn't feel too heavy, but what the heck is going on? Hey first throw of the day you guys oh i was gonna say just a bunch of scrap wires and nails it looks like but yeah look at it is just like a sinker because you can see the fishing line on there but i was wondering i was looking at these little beads what the heck is that i've never seen that on a sinker before well check it out you guys we got us a big old sinker first find of the day we'll take her baby i finally got whatever the heck that heavy thing was dude oh you got something heavy here this is seriously what is that? What the Whoa, dude! Oh, <laughs> what the? <gasps> that, no way, yo! Seriously, heavy. Now that's cool, yeah, dude. You know what that is? That's somebody's like homemade grappling that's, hook, or probably somebody's homemade anchor. That's what I was. What, what the was heck, you guys? Thought, Look at this thing with the rope on there yeah, and everything. Really weld, and there's weights welded on. Oh there, yeah, dude. for sure. No way, dude. Unreal. Now, if I'm correct, you guys, I'm pretty sure I actually saw a sign somewhere on the bridge here that says there is an underwater cable running and it says don't drag anchors and you can actually see it right over there but you probably can't see it on the camera but you can see big old tubes going under the water and they run all the way to the other side of the bridge over here and i'm sure that's probably what people are getting their anchors and stuff snagged on down there man Now, hopefully we can avoid those cables running under here with the magnets. I don't know if they would stick or what. I don't know. Something here. Maybe that's the cable. <laughs> I don't know, man. You know, we want to be careful about that. Ooh, a little something on there anyways. Oh, you guys, look at this. Oh, no way. At first, I was going to say this is a knife, probably, but look at the way it's shaped. It almost looks like an old school barber shaver or something. You know what I'm talking about? Clearly, shave your sideburns. Holy cow, you guys. Look at the old wooden handle on there. It's just totally deteriorated, man. And all the rust on the blade. That is a pretty cool find. How old do you think that bad boy is? We got the old shaver. Of course, our camera died at the time. We're going to pull this up, but look at this creature, guys. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What the heck knife. was that? Ooh. I stuck something here. Dude, I got something with some weight. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Is this the anchor? Do I have our anchor? No. This feels really heavy, dude. Really? This is really heavy. What is this? Oh my, oh my, oh my. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, there's not much to grab, hold on. No, I got it, hold on. I got it. Dude, <laughs> ah, look at you guys. Is that an exhaust? Yup, look at, holy, or not an exhaust, yeah, a muffler. Oh my goodness, you guys, look at this thing. No doubt this one's old, look at that. Part of it's chewed up and missing, my goodness. Stacking up the cart. Oh, look at that one, man. I caught me a little bike flasher. At least I think that's what that is. Or not a bike flasher, a bike reflector. Is that the front or the back? I think you gotta have a red in the back and the white's probably for the front, I think. There's gotta be a couple bikes in here. Alex got something big on here. Like, is that really coming up? What in the world, dude? Whoa, careful. 
There you go. Hey. Oh, what is that? Oh. What's the big thing? Oh. Oh. Dude! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> that is really cool. Look at the hook on the end of there, dude. My goodness, man. It's like a big old bridge tensioner or something. You can see the threads on there and it's got two massive hooks on each end here, you guys. I've never seen anything like this. And check this one out, you guys. He also had this on there. We got the old bottomless bowl. Pretty cool, man. Just stuck something there and this is coming up baby yeah check it out we are literally right underneath uh the drawbridge park here and i got something hopefully it's not our own anchor stand on the other side this is pretty heavy you guys oh hold on what is going on i think i'm stuck on something uh oh uh oh here we go Dude, shut oh, up! There it is, Are man. you kidding me, man? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bro! I think that's what Oh I'm my four. gosh, you guys. Those. Unbelievable, you guys. I don't even know how many anchors we're at now that we pulled out of here. This is ridiculous. This one's not a massive one, but look at that. It still swivels too, dude. Holy cow. This one's a little bit smaller of an anchor, but still, you guys, I bet you this is still a $30 anchor. Oh, look at that, dude. Check it out, you guys. Alex found himself a little shock off of a car. So now you caught a shock and I caught the exhaust. And I said huh. before, it feels like I'm clicking on a car. There. Like, <laughs> Maybe there is, dude. We got a big old iceberg coming towards us. This thing's gonna smack us, dude. You guys ever seen the movie The Titanic? <laughs> Seriously. Uh-oh. This might not be good, dude. She gonna smack us. That's a big old iceberg too, dude. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, snap. She's pushing us. Oh, I think that's what's going to happen. It's just it's just going to push us down river, dude. Unreal, you guys. <laughs> really? Grab that shit. It's insanely heavy. Is it actually coming up? No way. What the heck is on here? <laughs> what the dude, heck is that? No clue. My goodness. Dude, it's a piece <laughs> of the SS. <laughs> who knows, man? Look at that. <laughs> you guys, look at this flipping thing. I honestly thought it was a sign. I thought it was a sign when I seen oh, it coming up. But uh, no, I don't know. It's got some like pins Both going through the back the here. Back. Huh. <laughs> Did that wind die down? It feels like it. All of a sudden without the wind, it's like not so bad out here. <laughs> Am I pulling something? Dude, I'm pulling something here, but I didn't feel it click. Oh, that's really weird feeling. That's really heavy too, dude. What is this? Oh my, that's heavy. Ooh, what is this? Oh man. Look at this, you guys. It looks like, at first, I seen this coming up. I thought we had like a street sign or something. We got the big old street sign looking pole here, but uh, no sign on the end. And if you look, it looks like there's a bolt on there where the sign maybe would have been. Huh, maybe there is a sign down there. rope wrapped up in my boots dude uh i got something on here well we got some decent weight but i think we're moving here so i don't know again do i have my own anchor or what boy that's heavy whoa that's whoa what is this here man whoa no way 
bro. You guys you look found it. it. <laughs> you guys look at what I just caught here. I caught me the whole rest of the exhaust piece. So we got the whole thing. Unbelievable. Between the pieces that Alex has found now and the pieces that I found, I don't know, man. I I'm starting to think there might be a car down there. It's like, holy cow. And look at this one. You can kind of see like the mesh. Like what piece is that? Flex. You see that? That's the flex part. I was gonna so say, it, it looks flexible. And you go over bumps, this will allow it to flex because the exhaust is hung by the Ah, bottom. that makes sense. Yeah, so when the engine torques, huh. it allows it to flex. Holy cow, you guys. How many crayfish buddies do you think we got living in that one? Who knows? Alex has something on here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, on here. oh my I goodness. I think oh. I got an idea of what it is. And dude. there's fishing lure on there too. Yeah. I see. Dude. Oh my gosh, oh, you guys. Dude. Got it? Yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Bro. Oh my gosh. Someone really threw a oh, bike. Stop, stop, stop. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Oh, what? Look at it. Oh, Look at it. Sorry, sunglasses, yo. Oh Are they old? They're Chanel's. Does that look like a CC to you? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> and I did see some color dangling. Like, where oh, was yeah, that? Yeah, that's a fisherman. Yeah, nightmare. there's like, right there's got to be a couple fish sure, lures man. in there. Heck yeah. Holy yeah. cow, man. I really wouldn't expect a bike to be down <laughs> there. Like, put them suckers on. You go Stevie <laughs> Wonder <laughs> up in here. Oh, not only did we fill up our cart here, but look at we got metal stacked up all the way around this boat. This is crazy. <laughs> That's Holy the big cow, one. Hey, check this guy out. Frankie the Clown, man, that's a lobster right there, buddy. All right, you guys, unfortunately, that is gonna wrap our video up here for today. I'm getting real sick of the snow and the cold, you guys. Spring needs to hurry up and get here. Tons of super crazy stuff, you guys, and once again, we filled our cart all the way to the top. So again, another super successful day out on the water. What is going on today, guys? It is a little bit after 8 p.m. and we're gonna be trying something that I've never tried before. We're gonna be doing some magnet fishing at night out on the boat. I bought a great big 30,000 lumen work light. I also have my headlamp light and we're gonna see how well lit up we can get this boat. I have no idea if this is gonna work at all, you guys. We might not be able to see it all once we get out there. But I'm gonna give it a shot and we're gonna see if it works. Now we did just get 17 inches of snow today and I just had to spend 30 minutes shoveling out this entire boat ramp. So we're gonna put this boat in the river, you guys. We're gonna head out there and we're gonna see if we can find anything tonight. Let's see what time we got right now. 8.01 p.m. I brought my boat all the way out here to try and do some night magnet fishing and I can't even put the boat in unless I shovel out the entire way. So before we even try to back the boat in, you guys, we gotta shovel us a massive path into the water. You guys, boom, check this out. This is my brand new purchase here for night fishing. We're gonna see how this works. I got the Power Smith. This is a 30,000 lumen work light. We're gonna stick this thing right in the back of the boat and I think it stands up pretty tall. So I'm thinking if I stand this thing up in the back of the boat and point the light down towards me, we should have quite a bit of light in there, you guys. All right, guys, I got the boat ramp shoveled out. I got our big old 30,000 lumen work light set up. We're gonna go ahead and see if we can put this boat in the water and hopefully we don't slide into the water. <laughs>
All right, guys, let's plug these bad boys in. 30,000 lumen work light, man. We're gonna see how bright these bad boys are. Oh, oh, dude, now we're talking, buddy. Hold on a second. And wait, I think I can raise these up too. Hold on. Oh yeah, dude, you gotta be kidding me. Dude, now this is crazy, you guys. Look at, this entire boat is lit right up, man. Looks like it's the middle of the day. I need sunglasses. I'm gonna get this boat fired up here and uh, we're gonna buzz down the river, you guys. We're gonna find us a spot to magnet fish. While we wait for that to warm up, I can't forget, I have to put these lights on here. These are actually like, these are the lights that you legally have to have on for boating at night. Uh, well, I got this thing uh, plugged in here, but it doesn't look like it's lighting up. I don't like that, you guys. Am I supposed to flip a switch or something? Navigation, is that what that's for? Oh, yes, buddy, we got light. Heck yeah, you guys. So the back light's working, now I just gotta hook up the front light. Um, not good, you guys. This light is not working, man. I just shoveled out an entire boat ramp, loaded my boat in the river. I don't think I can go without this. I have to have this. This is like necessary, It's you have to. All right, guys, check it out. I just ran to Walmart, and what time is it now? We got 10.49. I had to run to Walmart, and I don't have time to rewire a whole one of these lights. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna duct tape this thing to the battery, and I'm just gonna kind of put the wires on here. Boom. And just like so, now we have a front light. <laughs> it's not a very permanent setup, but it's definitely gonna work for tonight. I'm gonna untie us here and we're gonna head down the river, see if we can find us a spot to go magnet fishing. Hopefully we don't have no more floating iceberg chunks coming down the river, cause I'm sure those would be like impossible to see in the dark. Slow, no wake through the bridges. Check it out, you guys. This bridge has got tons of cool lights on it. Oh, hello. I just stuck something really hard. What is this one, you guys? Uh, what do we got here? Holy big old bolt. My goodness. Look at that thing. That is the last thing I was expecting to pull up, dude. That thing stuck so hard. You could probably hear it click it was so hard. I think I got something, you guys. Oh, oh yes, yeah, sir. What do we got? A little bit of weight on there. Ooh, look at that, man. It almost looks like some kind of pulley to me. Yeah, like maybe a rope or a chain or something might have ran on there. Who knows? All right, you guys, check that one out. We got us the old pulley piece. Now, I want to show you something quick here. We got to take the trolling motor over to the shore. I don't know if something used to go on in this area back in the day, but check this out. Can you guys see like that wood? There's wood and it almost looks like maybe there used to be a building Back in the day here, I have no idea, man. That's kind of what it looks like to me. See that wood? Yep, and look at big old bolt. Another big old bolt sticking out of the, the side there. There was definitely some kind of building in this area back in the day, I think. So really, there's no telling what this thing came off of, what it was used for, and who knows what else is in here. Something on there. Definitely something on there. Oh my goodness, what the heck do we got here? Oh, uh, yeah, whoa. Look at, dude, I caught a leg. <laughs> you guys, what? Oh, we almost sent that one back in the water. Look at, what the heck, man? That thing definitely came off of like some kind of action figure or something what on earth you guys now that is a funky find we caught us a leg dude and attached to it we got us a big old bolt probably something like one of those bolts i just showed you guys sticking out of that wood over there all right oh 
Oh, something here, guys. Again, very next throw, right after we caught the leg, I got something again. What do we got this time? The action figure himself? Probably not. Ooh. Whoa, buddy. Hold on a second, you guys. Whoa, dude. What the heck is this? Look at this thing. That is crazy looking. It's got this loop on here, but that almost looks like a knife, man. Like some kind of shank or something. Holy cow. What the heck do you guys think that one is, man? That one might be worth cleaning up to see what the heck it is. Super cool. Oh, bingo, you guys. Look at what it is. We got us the old cash money railroad spike. Just like I was saying with the horseshoes before, you guys. Seriously, we seem to find these everywhere. And that one is way too rusted on top, of course. You're definitely not going to be able to see the stamp on that one. Oh, man. I just landed right on something, dude. Yep. Oh, what do we got here? I'm kind of pulling myself right to it almost. Oh, yeah, buddy. This one's got some decent weight. Oh, come here. Come here. Oh, yeah. Whoa, that's actually really heavy. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, what is this, you guys? Oh, my gosh, that's pretty heavy. Come on. Oh, what is this? Oh, what? the heck is that um i have no clue what to think of that one it almost looks like some kind of piece off of like the a-frame that we found this one's got a big old slot in it just a big old scrap metal looking piece a little bit of cash and i seen some color definitely no hook left on that bad boy you guys we got us the old busted up yellow junk jig Oh, there's actually some stuff on here. How did I not feel that? Holy cow. No, really, dude. Look at, we got us a second railroad spike. But look at you guys. We got another fishing jig in there. Oh, and look at, I didn't even see that right away. We got us the old spinner blade or the spoon. Holy cow, you guys. So we got us a little two for one on the fishing lures. Man, this river is stacked full of all kinds of fishing gear, you guys. Oh, I just stuck something, dude. Heck yeah, man. Now this has got some weight to it. Wow. Wow. Oh, did we just stick something else? Wow, this is heavy, you guys. If this even comes up, holy cow. Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh, what in the? No, dude. Oh my gosh, bingo, buddy. You guys, this is absolutely insane. Oh, check that out. There goes the train at night. I'm not even sure if you can see it from here. What time do we got? 1.36, holy cow, buckle. You guys, this is honestly mind blowing. Every single time we come out in the boat without fail now, we find anchors every time. And look at this one, what the heck is that? There's like a bolt going through there. That looks old school, dude. Unbelievable, you guys. Yes, dude. And there was another funky looking piece on here. Look at this little Mickey Mouse looking thing. What the heck is that, man? Some kind of thin plate looking piece with the ears on there. You guys, heck yeah, man. Look at this. We started off pretty slow and next thing you know, we got us a big old anchor in the cart. And there's a lot of super cool stuff we're finding. Heck yeah, you guys. Magnificent on the boat at night here. This is working pretty slick. Hopefully we're getting good footage here with the lighting and everything. I hope this is turning out good.
Um, is there actually something on there? I've been bobbing the magnet up and down for how long now? I didn't even notice there was anything on there. Oh uh, yeah, looks like it anyway. Dude, holy cow. Well, first of all, it looks like we got us a big old bolt or something on there. But look at it. Look at you guys. We got another fishing jig, man. Holy cow. Look at the eyeballs on that sucker. The old googly eyes. That rubber is super beat up. Could probably just rip that sucker right off of there. And boom, man. We got us a brand new jig ready to go fishing. Heck yeah, you guys. This is nuts. Oh, what the? Ow. Hold on a second. There was something. Ow. Pinching my finger. Owie, what is that? Got a piece of metal poking me or something in my glove. Ouch. I just stuck something super hard, though, you guys. Oh, my gosh. What is that, dude? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, and it's coming up. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh, the weight, dude. We sucked it up out of the mud. I can feel it. Oh, what is this? Holy, dude, whoa. You guys, <laughs> look at this one, man. It's like a big old long shaft with some, uh, what you call it's on the end here. Couple holes in there. And I'm pretty sure the other end looks exactly the same. It does, dude. What the heck do you think this one is, you guys? <laughs> Holy cow, you guys, now we are stacking up some serious weight in this cart. What is this? Am I pulling something already? I threw it right next to shore here. <laughs> and look at this, right next to this big old cement pipe. I got something, but hold on, hold on a second. We are gonna crash, crash, crash. There we go. Oh my God. That's kind of heavy, man. Whoa, what in the world, dude? You guys, whoa, what the heck is this, man? I've never seen anything like this. Hold on, this is a stick, get that out of here. But you guys, what the heck is going on on this magnet right now? Look at all of these. I think these look like individual pieces, honestly. Uh, one, two, uh, three, four. Five and six. You guys, holy smokes, look at these things, man. What do you think these are? One toss, I landed on a big pile of these things. And I bet you there's more of them down there, honestly. Looks like some kind of giant staple or maybe some kind of pin i don't know right next to that little culvert drain over there we're gonna float back over there and try that again i don't know what these are nah -uh. <laughs> uh, immediately yep some heavy stuff again dude oh hold on gotta drive us away from the shore right next to the culvert again i'm telling you man I got some big heavy stuff again. What do you think? It's gonna be some more of them staples or something? Dude, it is. Whoa, okay, this is weird. Holy cow, you guys. Look at it. it. Looks like what? One, two, three more? Somebody's gotta know what these are or what they're used for. Look at them things. I don't know what to think here, you guys. This is crazy. Oh my gosh, you guys, look it. I just went to throw and I guess I've only been throwing out so much rope every throw. And look it, look at the whole rope is literally iced to the bottom of the boat. And I'm talking like, oh my gosh, look at that, man. If you don't think it's cold out here, think again. It is absolutely freezing. How much power do we got left on there? 65%? Not bad, man. And I got both lights on. I also have the battery pack plugged in, charging my battery the whole time. We got a slick little setup here. Oh, something on there, dude. Hey, man. 
What is this, you guys? Check that out. That definitely looks like some kind of tool or something to me. That looks like a handle. Definitely looks like it's broke here. Who knows what that thing is, you guys? It's a metal taser. Bzz, bzz. Not too bad, you guys. We pretty much filled our cart just about to the top. I would love to stay out here and keep tossing, you guys, but it is 2 o'clock in the morning. I still got a ways to go down river just to get off the water. Then I got to pack everything up. By the time I get home, the sun is just about going to be coming up. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to hit that thumbs up button for me and don't forget to subscribe.